Hi everyone, this is Miss Lynn from Lovely Decor, and on this evening, I am going to be bringing you my next tablescape. This is actually a tablescape I did last Saturday. It's been down for probably uh, two or three weeks now, but we had dinner on it last Saturday, and I wanted to get it back together after using the plates and things that I use. So yeah, this is my tablescape that I used last Saturday, had, but I had it down a couple weeks prior to last Saturday um, for a dinner that I hosted for uh, some of my family members that came. And it was just so nice. And I wanted to do something um, whimsical that um, would invite them in. So this table really became a conversational piece. And that's what I love about doing these tables. So I'm just going to run you through where some of the stuff came from and how I put this table together. And um, I like it because this year... For the spring, uh, if you've been following my videos, I've been telling you that I'm going to be using a lot of the bright colors this year. Um, I'm going back to my um, teal colors and stuff like that, but I'm going to be using some of the bright colors for the spring and summer. So this is what I call lemon drop <laughs> because of the colors that I use the lemons in here. So this is a combination of a table that came from, that I did the, uh, out of Home Goods, Hobby Lobby, and Pure One. So if we go to this placemat, and you're going to see my next tablescapes, and the tablescapes I'm doing are going to be kind of simple. Uh, I love over the top. Now, if you've been following me and my page, you know I love doing over-the-top tablescapes. I just love that. I think they are beautiful and they just, you can be creative and do so many different things. Um, so what I did in this tablescape, though, I wanted to be simple because we were going straight to the entree. We weren't going to have a salad and uh, none of that. We just had a cup of meats and um, vegetables and pastas that, Everyone could choose whatever they wanted and rolls that we set down on the table. Uh, we use these glasses here for water and we use these glasses here for some wonderful tea that I made, y'all. I have to, you know, beat my own horn. Beep, beep, because that tea was delicious. And um, the meal was too. So let me start right here with the placemat. This placemat right here, all of this stuff, this placemat and this napkin came from Home Goods. This plate set came from Home Goods. The plates were $4.99 each, and the placemat napkins were like $15. This uh, beautiful floral. Um, napkin ring is from Pure One. I love Pure One's napkin rings. They really are nice. And when you get them, you can get them when they're on sale or when they're in clearance uh, mode. And that's what I did with these right here. So I just made, um, I put my little string lights through here. I had this right here. And these lemons that you see here, artificial lemons, these actually came from my, um, collectible store that I frequent um, and I just put these on a tray because I was doing a lemon drop thing and I love this because it's so um, nice and open and bright and festive and inviting. Right here I took these uh, two bags of these lemons that you can purchase out of Hobby Lobby and they were like $4.99 a bag. And then I purchased these yellow florals right here that just happened to be on sale for like $4.99 per stem. And I really caught a sale on these because these can be pretty high for the types that they are the orchids. And 
this uh, particular type of yellow floor that this is, but I caught them on sale. But I actually too like those uh, yellow floors that come up and they're really tall. Uh, but they didn't have those on sale, so I said I'll just wait on those. But I did find these, and so I made like just center arrangement for this table. I'm going to back up a little bit so you can see it. These two things right here, the two big lemons, they were like $7.99 each, and they were out of home goods. I like that in the way they made the area. They just brought everything in together because we laid our food out up here and in my kitchen area. Yeah. So, oh yeah, this is my tablescape lemon drop. I love it. Over here, I even added like some lemons and lime inside of here. So when you came in, that's what you saw over here. We had a little bit of light music playing and it was just wonderful. It was good food and we had a great time. And I just like to do these tablescapes to give you some ideas on what you can do uh, when you're trying to do something for your family. Because I'm going to soon be changing out these chairs right here because I did go out uh, and I think I went to High Point, North Carolina and uh, the capital, furniture capital of the world. And I was searching around and went into some of the stores over there. And I did find a beautiful sofa, sectional sofa. But I'm going to be going back this weekend because I just want to make sure it's what I really want. I just don't want to get... Uh, anything and I, I'm just not anxious for anything uh, and just to get it at this time so I want to be I, I'm going to I'm deciding on whether I am going to be doing my pictures over here in the um, this area right here this is my wall of fame I'm thinking about adding a little color in this just for the spring I have a book, a bizarre book, and it has some really colorful pictures. So I'm going to let you know if I'm going to be doing this. But I do like this the way that it is now. And um, this is my office area. And I'm thinking about adding some color in my office. Uh, I like that turquoise. And my office is black and white, but you can always add a little color into it so anyway hmm, I don't know I just thought I'd come through and let you see but yeah this is my tablescape lemon drop it is beautiful I love it but I am going to get ready to change it out my sister wants this tablescape so I'm just going to be seeing about that but anyway this is Miss Lynn with lovely decor and I hope everyone is doing okay if you have not subscribed to this channel please do so um, and hit that notification bell so you're notified every time that we sit down a video God bless each one of you I hope you're doing okay I hope you're doing well and as I always say always go where you're celebrated and not where you tolerate it. And let me tell you something too. For some of you who are in a situation where you want to help people, I want to tell you, you know, even though it's in our instincts to want to help people, sometimes you're not going to be able to help people that you really want to help. But you can help them by putting them in God's hand. And maybe somebody here sends somebody along the path that would do what you're trying to do. Because I've learned that you can drain yourself. You can exhaust yourself trying to help people that don't receive your help. People that are not ready for your help. And it may be that you're not the one that's going to help them. I felt compelled to say that. So don't be discouraged. Just put them in God's hand and know that he has has it. This is Miss Lynn with Lovely Decor. Thank you so much for tuning in and I'll see you soon.